This is the Flower String Art Kit Tutorial by String Art by Kaylee. To make this design, you will need the flower kit, which can be ordered on my website. It comes with yarn bundles and your types of colors, and a pair of scissors. The very first thing we will do is remove the paper so we can string up the board. Grab the organza bag and go ahead and remove everything from it, keeping the yarn bundle for the flower petals in hand. With the yarn bundle for the petals, grab that strand of yarn wrapped around the middle and go ahead and unravel the bundle. We are going to pretend that these center nails are not even here and go right through that area as we string up the petals. With that same strand that we used to unravel the bundle, we are going to do a loop up in the air and then tuck that loop onto one of these nails and pull it tight. We will start by outlining the flower. Make sure that you push that yarn all the way down to the base of the nails. This outline will help us see exactly where we're going to fill in. Once your outline is complete, it is time to fill in. There is no certain way to do this. You can jump around like this as I'm doing now, or you can go in a pattern. The point is just to fill in and cover up as much board as you want. You can string up the petals as much or as little as you want. Just remember as you are stringing that you are pushing the yarn all the way down the base of the nails as the layers are going to help build up the height of the nail. It is likely you might run into some knots in your yarn as you're stringing. Just go ahead and unknot them and keep going. Just remember as you're stringing, the best thing to do is go in all different directions to help fill in the empty spaces. Once you like how full it looks, we will go ahead and do an outline around the whole entire flower again. This just helps to give it a nice smooth edge. To tie off our yarn, I like to cut it nice and long to give us plenty of room to tie. We'll make that same loop that we did in the beginning, tuck it onto one of the nails and pull tight. Just make sure it goes on one nail, not two. And then with this strand, I will just trim it to about a half an inch and tuck it in between the layers to help hold that knot. Now we will do the center and it's the same steps. Make that loop, tie it onto one of those inner nails, outline it and fill it in. Just like how we finish the petals, we'll go ahead and give it an outline and tie off. Super quick and easy, we now have a finished flower string art piece. I hope you guys enjoyed this tutorial. If you did, please give the video a like and subscribe to my channel for more tutorials. Thank you for watching.